Seb Cow. <laughs> Say hello, say hello to Hollywood. Say hello, say hello to Hollywood. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Monkeys, my name is Cam. Boom! This is Seb Cam in Hollywood. This is an amazing video, my favorite one ever. Because the reason I say it's the favorite, the most iconic, is the most memorable. Anybody anywhere in the world knows of the Hollywood sign. So if you say to them, you know the Hollywood sign, and they go, yeah, I've climbed up that. They go, wow, they can link the, the simple you know, facts together, the Hollywood sign, Seb, he's climbed up it. It doesn't take much explaining. It doesn't take any, uh, you know, considering and thinking about. It's just like, wow, I get that. that you know, that summarizes Seb perfectly. So welcome to Hollywood. Before I set off, before I left, we'd had a big uh, fancy dress party. Remember I mentioned that it was funny to dress up in funny different things? One of the things I decided for my leaving party that we would dress up as is, uh, was it nine friends? Is that how many letters? H-O-L-H-O-L-L-Y-W-U-U-D. Yeah, nine letters. <laughs> That's how good my math is. <laughs> uh, we all wore a different letter. So Haley was an H, of course, because she's called Haley. I can't remember. I think I was one of the O's. Um, we were all different letters, all my best buddies. We, we So we went out clubbing, partying, drinking, dressed as the Hollywood sign. I mean, what a brilliant idea. It took so long to make the letters and to try and, like, encourage people to wear them you know if you don't wear them then it's kind of ruined the the whole lineup so I'm pretty sure at the very opening sequence that's the picture that you will see that explains that that's you know that was the Hollywood party which was in England before I left the leaving party all right push the button oh tune postal service Great Heights. I love all those people, all my Hollywood crew. Sunset, Hollywood, Universal Studios, 7-Eleven. 7-Eleven? <laughs> oh, because I'm with Michelle, and she's the one, she's beautiful. She's the one who gave me this tune. So I wanted to put our tune on here. Thinking it's a sign. But the freckles in our eyes are mirror images and when we kiss they're perfectly aligned. It was like a song that had just come out that I'd never heard of. And I'm like, yeah, I love that song. Okay, pause it here. Now, we're parked on a hill and I'm pointing and you see the camera zoom in, zoom out. It all happens quite quickly, but this wasn't quick. This had taken like an hour. We've been driving around on the Hollywood Hills with our 7-Eleven Slurpees. I love Slurpees, man. They're like, in the UK we have Slush Puppy and they come in these tiny little cardboard cups with a tiny little straw and it's gone in, you know, two minutes with a bit of brain freeze. In America, of course, they do everything big so you can get a slushy Slurpee thing that's like, I don't know, 32 ounces or something. I mean, it's just ridiculous. Just so much frozen sugar. I love it. So we go and get a Slurpee. We're listening to this tune. And she's got this uh, convertible car. And she's a proper, like, you know, gorgeous California girl. You know, blonde, beach babe. And I'm just so happy. It's just, just like a dream come true. Because in the morning, she says to me, what will we do today? And I'm like, we're going to climb the Hollywood sign. She's like, what? Really? Do you know how to get there? And I'm like, no. I just figure we'll drive around. Anyway, it wasn't that easy. So when I turn the camera on and I zoom in, and I'm saying, we, I want to go there. No way. <laughs> it's miles away. We want to go up there. We're trying, but we can't seem to get near. No matter what roads we take, we end up like, we're way over here and the sign is over here. Um, there's no direct route, so we kept on persevering. Well, I think you see in the video, the perseverance uh, 
montage. She's like, we're not getting up there because we're on a road and you can see across there, it's not even a road. That's what I didn't expect. The Hollywood sign doesn't have a road. It's just a big mountain. You have to hike. It's not like uh, accessible with pathways and stuff. There is round the back. It turns out that we found out later there is an official uh, viewing point, but you can't get up close to the sign. You can't climb on it. You can't touch it. It's just a road round the back of the hill. So she's just skeptical, you know, we're not getting up there. I love her accent. We're not getting up there. We're, we're this high up and we're on a road and look how high up that is. It's like, that's where you start to realize mountains are massive. You think, oh, I'll go up that mountain over there. It says Hollywood on it. You spend hours trying to get close to the mountain and it still looks far away. You're like, you know what? This is bigger distance than I kind of, uh, you know, our eyes can can visualize, can have a concept of how big a mountain is. We need a whole day to get up there. I was like almost giving up. That's a dead end. Now we got the rooftop down. Yeah, and at this point I'm like, we're going the right way, we're going the right way. Even though we seem more like in a city now. In, in surface streets, we get to the end of the surface street. I'm like, yes, we're now at the base of it. <laughs> Got to pause on the sign. Got to pause on that sign. Read it carefully. Restricted entry. Mountain Fire District. No hiking allowed to the Hollywood sign. I'm like, what? That's the whole purpose of my trip. I've, I've flown out here. I've got this gorgeous blonde girl. I've said we're going out for the day. We're going to climb up the sign. And we're straight away we're confronted with no hiking to the Hollywood sign. Violators subject to arrest and a $103 fine. Such a random number. 103 I wish I had $103 on me ready. But actually we're, we're just broke sort of... Uh, Wanna be film stars, <laughs> put it that way. So we haven't got $103 to spend on getting to the sign. So we're gonna have to go into covert operation ninja mode. Oh my God. <laughs> I love her voice. Brilliant. Yeah, there's helicopters. Over way up there. So I leave her with the camera. Looks like it'll take a while. So yeah, off I go, leaving her with the camera. And I said, I think I turn around now when I say it. Uh, I'll call you when I'm in the O. Like I'll, I'll get on my phone and I'll ring you so you know when to zoom in. Because I know you probably can't see me when I'm right up there. It's so far away. It takes about 30 minutes. Probably 20, maybe 20, 30 minutes to get up there. Try the I'll try to stand in the O. He's not going to make it. <laughs> Everything looks perfect from far away. No way! There he is! He's right there! He's right there! Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna fall! Some crazy shit! <laughs> Pause that! Some crazy shit! I was so happy for a few things. Number one, she was able to zoom in, even though it's wobbly and blurry, you can see I'm dangling in the O, I'm waving my feet around. And number two, at this early stage of 2006-ish, they haven't got security at the Hollywood sign. They now have a security guard who is there 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and there is a security camera on the Y. 
So there's a globe kind of uh, CCTV, you know, spinning uh, camera and motion detectors and cops up at the top with an SUV, you know, gangsters in sunglasses and uniform and helicopters. Did I say helicopters already? <laughs> Basically, I've, I've been up there since and everybody swoops on you and I had to walk away. I, I went back down the mountain. They weren't able to catch me on my second time round. But um, it definitely wasn't. I didn't can climb up the sign. So this is even more special because it can't really be repeated without having to be taken away by some enforcement officers, answering lots of questions, paying the fine. You know, it's is it worth it? Selfies from the top. That's the view of Hollywood from the Hollywood sign. Out through the O. <laughs> Everything looks perfect from far away. Come down now. Brilliant. You can see that there's no way to jump between the letters. They're as far apart as a car, you know, or maybe further, two cars distance. They're they're massive. It's it's nothing like what the guys in England imagined, like go up the Hollywood sign Seb and jump across the letters. It's uh it's way more distance than that, way more massive. Like imagine a six-story apartment building, you know, like it's about that size. Each level, you know, a house normally has ground level windows and then it has the bedroom windows. Okay, now stack three houses on top of each other. That's about as big, six stories, as the Hollywood sign. And uh, yeah, they're, they're at least a car or two cars distance between the letters. Cool, that was good reminiscing. I enjoyed that. I'm going to uh, stop watching now and upload these videos and then we'll come back and we'll watch more. And then we're finally getting to the journey. I just wanted to kind of establish the Hollywood foundation and then the journey sets off. Day one, departure from the Hollywood sign. Maybe I just do it now. You know what? Let's do it now. I'm right here. My name's Seb. This is the cam. Let's set off. It's day one in Hollywood. Boom! Tonight, take an exclusive behind-the-scenes look at everyone's favorite TV series. It's Seb Cam. <laughs> yeah! We've become bored with watching actors give us phony emotions. We're tired of pyrotechnics and special effects. No scripts, no cue cards. It isn't always Shakespeare, but it's genuine. It's a life. We want to go up there, but it's a long, long way. We're not getting up there. Arrested on 30. Oh my god. No way. This is some crazy shit.